I want to pray for this nation. Nataka tuombe taifa letu. Nataka unisikize. I want us to pray for this nation. I want to see the wolf is praying. Mungu akanipeleka in one of the spirits. Na hii taifa ikawekwa mbele yangu. And I saw four corners of this nation. There were four flags on the four corners. Nikona kwamba side ya kwanza kuna bendera imepandishwa na imestikiwa. Do I saw another corner kuna bendera imepandishwa na imeachwa inapepea pale. Another corner but there was one corner. Hiyo bendera imewekwa juu alafu kuna watu wamekuja wamerudisha chini. And uh, I was the, I was in the office but I was this What is happening? Na nini kinaendelea? And let's let's pray for this nation. Hata before they will want us to pray for this nation. Maneke kuna kona moja. Shetani nataka kwamba after these erections kukuwe na mvurutano na vita. One side, side moja. I saw it clearly in the office. That's why nimesema kwamba that's nilikuwa natomeka tomeka we pray for this nation before anything else. Ile madhabahu imeinuliwa ili kukuwa na side moja kuna kona moja kuna kona moja kuna kona moja nasema kuna kona moja kulikuwa kona hii moja ilikuwa sawa kona hii ilikuwa sawa but kuna kona moja kuna kona moja bendera imepandishwa alafu kuna watu wamekuja wameitremsha kukawa hakuna bendera wale wale wanajua about bendera speaks of freedom freedom so kuna side moja shetani anataka kukose amani kukuwe na msuka suko and why no church alafu he make it tengenezo vizuri tafadhali uh, anataka at uh, this time maneke we are going to pray watu ibada ya kwanza wamesema tumeomba bado hatukuomba kwenye ibada ya kwanza i know tumeomba more than 30 and above but this ibada ya pili tuna time nzuri sana before we pray for families before we pray for businesses this I want us to pray for this nation. Musuko suko shetani anapanga. Madhabahu yote ya kumwaga damu, madhabahu yote ya vita, madhabahu yote ya watu kuvutana. Church we carry that power. We carry that anointing to fight us our forces and to fight us all those demonic authors. Shetani anazinua. Hakuna damu hiyo inamwagika buri. Easy ajali mbona zinafanyika kwa barabara? Hakuna ajali zinafanyika ga if you know. Sometimes kuna watu ambao wanatumika in order of spirit to reverse activities to those accidents. Wana mwaga damu kwa barabara. Nyinyi mnafikiria tu ni damu mwagika. Unasikia kwamba nisikize na niwelewe. Thank you mami amesema kwamba niongee juu ya why. Kuna <laughs> let me just put it clear to you. Kuna queen of heaven, kuna queen of heaven. <laughs> Uh, si kila mvua inatoka kwa Mungu. Mark my statement. Si kila mvua inanyesha inatoka kwa Mungu. I know mnasema kwamba mvua ni baraka, but you understand hata kwa dream, si kila mvua unaona kwa dream inamaanisha baraka. Kuna wengine inamaanisha troubles. Na kuna wakati mwingine kuna mvua na mafuriko yanakuja, yanabeba watu wanatolewa sacrifice. And that's what happened. Let me just put it this. Let me just put it like this. I know Nicole have no problem. Listen to this. Oh. Na jaribu maneno simple ya kuwa put. Ku put hapa hivi sasa ni siwezi kutamka maneno mazito. But what do I say hivi? Zero seven wakati kulikuwa na vita. I remember kuna agent mmoja tuliombea. Hako agent manake alikuwa a satanist, a very strong man. Number three from Satan. Very strong man. Ambaye tulipomwombea alianza kutoa pembe huku kwa shingo. Pembe zikaanza kutoka kwa shingo kuna statement niliandika I remember hiyo kitabu niliangalia nikaisoma na akasema kwamba wao wenyewe hiyo vita ilipraniwa underground hii damu na hii damu ilimwagika au alipomwaga sasa ingine ikamwaga ikawa sasa hizo damu sasa hazina nguvu kwa sababu saidi moja ilikuwa nafaa imwague damu 
lakini isimwogwe damu ili madhaba yako yakuwe na nguvu hapo wakati but wakati hii ilimwogwa damu na ikamwogwa damu na ufano wa giza inakuwa hivi they fight with the sacrifices that's the kingdom of the devil they fight with the sacrifices that's why wakati walitoa sacrifice alafu wengine wakaja sasa ku defend wakawa sacrifice nao ikawa nali fight sasa wao wakawa hawana nguvu hasa ile assignment agenda yao ilikuwa nataka ifanyike haiko fanyika and listen to this Kenya has a prophetic destiny This, that's why nitazidi kuwa against watomao unaangalia mtu wenu una prophesy ni yeye atakuwa president na Mungu hataongea unaangalia mkikui amu nitakuwa against hii mpaka itoke kwa sababu siwezi angalia mkikui ni mwambie utakuwa president au niangalie mkamba atakuwa kwa sababu mimi ni mkamba i'm supposed to speak from the throne of heaven if Mungu amesema ni mkamba sasa watu hata wakikoa god anafaa kusema hivyo Mungu hafai kwa confuse Yes no way huyu huyu nabii anaweza kusema ati ni mjaruo atakuwa president ayo mkika, mkikamba na yeye anasema kwamba ni mbaruya alafu anasema ah, ah, ah. the voice inatoka from god na voice ya Mungu haifai kuwa na confusion Church inataka tukue dakika 3 minutes just 3 minutes let's pray for this nation tuombe viongozi wetu tutangaze kwamba the will of god will prevail tutangaze kwamba hakuna damu itamwagika let's pray for the peace of god let's pray for the masses of god Three minutes right now for the masses of god fakota karababanda risha takata maboti kiriboshia tamazaya hiyo mike msuhuza tafadhali ikae to hapo rabaka toko shitikari bota pray for this nation the creator will of god about to prevail tangaza madhabahu yote ya kifo ta miakata damu haitamwagika kwa taifa la Kenya we pray for the masses of God in shanga ya Kenya haitakunywa damu ya watu iko tata ratatu tutaya tutaya tunaweza kumwomba madhabahu kwa mchanga washiri paka tarama yano wesetetata tarama tote ya tata sharipu taya matoto ya sata fedha we surrender before you we know you are bagasa you live and forever we are there for laza we are there to fight for laza we are there God to protect us Father we believe in your heart oh atakata manu titi ni detali ya shata la 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 tata mama shata Kenya belong to you Kenya belong to you Jehova Kenya belong to you all counties belong to you father all leaders belong to you salata tata tata ya shanda we pray and see about the taka ni eba batakalia kiti we pray and pray about the shahua ni atakalia kiti father zile tama no mashahua ni eba atakalia kiti ile prato to mambo mashahua ni atakalia kiti father hakutakuwa na mvurutano hakutakuwa na vita la shapa katalosita we stop katalosita bravo sia tala matata I declare the spirit of Antichrist. 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 I decl
name of Jesus. I declare Bola for my sonica. Goes over Pia Satan and Pia Tata. La Rote Tete Ketokote Azata. Hey, Jesus. Oh, God, thank you, Jesus. Shala Katoke Vasiaba. Shereketa Kereba Shita Kalabosha. Let me just make a film. Listen, church. Let me just clear this. Kuna Kito Satan and Kona Panga. Before erection is a fiki, what the Kwanza Kufa and the Kofi. Me. That's kuna coffee now before Mpaka Nini. Ugana Kobo may nuka sana. It before erections cook for what? But let me tell you, how what I cook for in the name of Jesus. <laughs> we carry power to silence death. And I want to declare, I could not damn you, been a damn with a mogeka hapa. It is a tanya for you. We pray in the blood of Jesus. Every time we are used to crystal, it might get a comusaraba. It must look at the mission. And I want to declare for today. And the brother covenant. And the come of a kill son of a Kenya. Come in the name of son of a Kenya. Ya kumbu mataka zika. Kumbu mataka zika. Ya kumbu mataka zika. In the name of Jesus. But we pangu ya shatani meisha nguvu. If we're going to kill a comba, what are the kufa or kueka my sacrifice? I say this in the same time. COVID was programmed in hell. Like it or not. It was a demonic arrow. I know people are fighting to me. Some of you are Na maumbi, miyo mefanya kazi. Kile ki mefanya COVID ishe nkuvu. It is prayers. Let me say it again. Kile ki mefanya COVID ishe nkuvu. It is prayers. Iri ya jena shetani kwa mepanga. Especially. The realm ile maya ya underground. Especially watobona taka kuwasha. Wanapanga kuwasha antichrist. Kwa mepanga jena maya sana. But after prayer. <laughs> we are still alive by the grace of God. And let me declare this bit of woga. Hatuta zika watu wetu primachuari ya kain. Hatuta zika watu wetu primachuari ya kain. In the name of Jesus. Na damu ya watoto wetu. Yani mili ya watoto wetu haita wekwa kwa grave. Ikuwa haita ufikisha tamu yao. Hawa ya serve the purpose of God. We declare even cancer. We know we have an agenda. Na kasa we address you. How to funga taifa letu. How to funga familia setu. How to funga watoto wetu. How to funga our brothers and our sisters. We cast all cancer. We cast all cancer. In the name of Jesus. Cancer is a demon. It is eating people. And swallowing the destiny of so many great people. Kanisa leo. Those altars we are dressing. Those altars are magojo mekine. About the demonic. About how you fight. Ino mkono sema kadika tina reso kuriso. Sema madhabahu yote ya kansa. Ya mekalia familia zetu. Hayo madhabahu ya kansa. Wache ya funfike na mutu wabwana. Wache ya funfike. Madhabahu ya kansa. Haya nanguvu meri yetu. Haya nanguvu kwa wa brothers. Na kwa wa sisters. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Watu watu watayeshi. Hawata kufu primachwari. Hawata uduwe na diabetes. Hawata uduwe na asus. Hawata uduwe na asthma. Hawata uduwe na pneumonia. Hawata uduwe na atizima. Hawata uduwe na stroke. Hawata uduwe na tebei. Hawata uduwe na tuma. Hawata uduwe na guan. We declare to have a zwapa. Before the church queer up chance, we must preach this gospel 
and win souls. Niliambia for service hapa the time has come after zile declarations tuna make today. Wakora wale wezi wakari sana watakuja ku confess kwa church na wa receive Christ. You don't understand what I'm saying. The time has come after kile tunatangaza maana leo tunanenea mpaka hii mchanga. Wacha na wale bwana sema hatumwagi mafuta tutamwaga before complete to mwaga. Hello. Before complete to narudia tena kumwaga wewe endelea kusema tunamwaga tena. As long as in work I don't care. This is a time we are supposed to win souls. We are supposed to bring people to Christ. Tunafaa kuona wale wao wamekuja wamehubiri Kristo hapa. I'm longing to see time. Hata before to the Coroco Cathedral. Natamani kuona mganga ambaye tamekuja. Na ameweka vitu vya uganga hapa kwa ota. Na amesema kwamba nimekataa uganga Paul alina pale Ephesus and he preached the gospel and the Bible says wa chawi walikuja na vitabu vyao walikuwa na andika watu na mahali walikuwa na andika wale wamelipa wale hawajalipa wakaleta furugu vyao wakapiana pahali pale vikachomwa the time is coming tunachomwa vitu vya wa chawi the time is now We are called to preach Christ and to bring people to the knowledge of God and the knowledge of Jesus and they receive God. Angalia mwanzo kumwambia wakati wao umeisha. Angalia mwanzo kumwambia wakati wa kufanya kumwambia mtu juu ya Kristo umeisha. Nataka niakisha moto kwa mtu ambaye kwa mahali hapa. Wacha ukikaa mahali unafanya kazi unachomeka ukinyamaza. Uweze kutomeka kama Jeremiah. Anasema kwamba najaribu kunyamaza siwezi. Maana kwa fire of God na choma my bones. Can this the time is now? Mahali pepepo lepo. Preach the Christ. Wote ni kwa gari hapa ni Kristo. Kwa hiyo ya proto. Nafu kwa kanda mekoka. Natangaza kwa nafsi kwa leo. Wacha moto wake ndani yako. Paka watu proto ile kama ile pona kai. That's a thing. Manake tumeitwa to silence these things. Angalia mwanzo kumwambia tumenyamaza sana. Angalia mwanzo kumwambia kuna generation ilikuwa imefichwa. Bara saa hii Mungu ameitoa na inatoka na moto mkubwa sana. I say inatoka kwa moto mkubwa sana. In the morning wakati ningekuwa kwa ofisi. I like kwa ofisi kidogo. Manake you have a quiet time with your father. And when you have a, a, a moment of silence with your father, you hear from your father. There's something that disturbed me. And then I came out and I came out and I was in the morning. I came out and I was in the morning. And I came out and I was in the morning. And I saw a mama who was in the morning. She was in the morning. Niko na miguu imekaa hivi. Watoto walikuwa miguu imekaa hivi. Wengine hawakuwa, wengine walikuwa wafani sana. But wakuwa naletwa niko naona kwamba ijiri kihubiriwa and so many so, so many children by the way ambao miguu imekaa kando. In fact hata before ijiri hubiriwe, wamama walikuwa wanaleta kwa ijiri tu hivyo wanaanza kutembea, wanaanza kutembea. And I believe this is both spiritual and physical. Na mimi nakumbuka kuna healing, kuna grace ya healing before the rapture of the church Mungu miachilia. Watu wataponywa, watu watatoa vile wameponywa. But that grace of healing baba naachilia. But if I believe kuna watu ambao watakuwa destiny zao zitakuwa restored back. Watu ambao zikabata walk to their destiny. God atanyosha miguu again na watapanya watu their destiny. Watu ambao walikuwa ni kwa signature in your life. Ya kwamba hawezi kutembea or seek to their destiny. I want to declare the tables now. My I believe that's what is happening. I believe we're in that dimension. We're in that dispensation. I can mwanzo kumwambia ile ya mtu konayo sasa. Mwambie mwanzo kumwambia tumeingia ile season ya miujiza ambayo haijulikani. Yaani unakutana na kipofu hata haujamwombea tu umemwangalia tu hivyo kipofu anaona kwa sababu you carry that grace 
unatembea tu hata haujuki kunafanyika unaangalia watu hivi wanapokea ukombozi Bible says kuna time Peter tembea na hii grace paka Bible inasema kwamba kivuri chake akipita tu watu wanawekwa tu na guzo na kile kivuri alafu watu walikuwa wanatembea listen to me church hiyo grace already imeachiliwa i see hiyo grace already imeachiliwa i see hiyo grace already imeachiliwa we are going to see it very soon ya kwamba watu wengine hawataambia kuna watu tu wanaleta tu unapita tu mahali wako na miujizi ndani ya kutendeka maana kwa hiyo kitu biashara na hizi signs and wonders maana kwa hiyo believers we are caught to that level kuna kitu kinanijenga sana nataka unisikize kuna kitu kinanijenga sana we need to be like what my wife amesema yakob if this man of god abaye ametuambia hapo if we man of god alitoka from judah can be there na juko ba judah the, the southern kingdom na bethan the northern kingdom walikuwa both were enemies maana kwa rehoboam na jeroboam they were enemies but mungu alijoko ba sita tumia mtu ambaye ako bethan nitatumia mtu from another place the time has come mungu atatumia watu wa tribe zingine wa break message kwa tribe zingine The time has come. Mungu anatoa baruya, anapita kwa kikuyu, anatapa injili kwa kikuyu. Bila hizo sasa, the man was not from Bethel. The man was from Judah, anaenda pale. Angalia mwanzo kwa baba get ready. Manake baba anakutoa sio kwenu, anakutoa mahali ya joy. Manake time ya kwa stagnate na kwa continue forever. Ukisikia kwamba unatumwa Uganda hausijali. Unatolewa wa Judah unapeleka Bethel. Angalia mwanzo akamwambia baba ataanza kukutuma. Unaweza kutoka baba amekutuma kitari. Hey, Wapogo don't joke baba anaweza kutuma wewe unapiga keyboard wewe unaona wewe unapiga keyboard Tanzania. Why manake baba anakupoa from pl- Why bache msejari mkiwa na baba ameweza kumtuma. Manake the man of God was from Judah to Bethel. He was from another tribe. He was from another kingdom from southern to northern. And I want to decrease the grace. My home of the places. I say my home of the places. I say my home of the places. By the word of God. Amen. This man of God. And he took from Judah. Now let's see. I can't even say come on be. I can't even say come on be. Watch this one. Mangali, it is not a surprise. Baba kutume kwa madui wako. Baba kupe maono ya yule ambaye anakuroga. Hai! Pakosha taka bagatama. Lepo kotekete mazaya. Yoshi bakata. Baba kupe message ya yule ambaye anakataanga na bwanako. Yokoe! Pakoto kuzoteka. Baba kupe message. Na mtu ya mtu ambaye anakamata pesa zako anazipeleka kwa ufawi. Zano go by the word of God. Ukirekea kwa biashara yake, umwambie na mkoja by the word of God. Ili hapo unafanya kazi nayo. Oh, oh, oh. Cast the fire of God. This man. This man alitoka Juda. Akirekea Bethel by the word of God. I brief maybe alikuwa ameketi kwa kwa nyumba. Babu hatujui mpaka anaitwa nani kwa sababu Mungu hajali kana kwamba unajulikana vile unaitwa. Niliambia watu asubuhi hajali kana kwamba unaitwa chief apostle au unaitwa doctor professor. Those titles are good. But the time has a price when it comes to mambo ya spiritual. This was called man of God. Angalia mwanzo kumwambia the time has come. Watu ambao wamejidharau na hawajulikani baba atumie hao i know kuna watu boko hapa na jidharao who told you mungu hauwezi kufungua afungue biashara yako wakuwe financial minister hey, who am i prophesying to right now you know let me remind you this is a prophetic sunday so any word can fall na iko ni prophetic to you i know kuna watu boko hawezi kubiri wewe huko but baba naweza i know financially na wanunua gari ya kuhubiri baba naweza Baba na sapia mari na sema kwamba hapana mimi na support ministry siwezi kuvuta raisa baada ya support ya tano waende mpaka na nuki the boss christ may i receive that grace i say may i receive that grace angalia mwanzo kumwambia kupokea mpaka pesa 
Ndio kama unaweza kuwa mami hawezi hubiri. But Mungu akupe pesa kama dadi hapa. Imagine kama dadi hapa. Anaweza kuwa sasa haezi hubiri. But Mungu anaweza kupea pesa. Kusema kwamba hapana. Au watu ili waende hubiri ni mimi. Hata drum set ili kubwa. Mimi ni wanunulia. Waende hubiri njiri. Cho cho cho. Ay 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 ay. Akili mweza kumwambia gospel inahitaji pillars. Sijui nikina nani anakuwa anasema pastor, mimi natamani Mungu natamani tu Mungu anipe pesa. Nikuwe hata pila ku sponsor hata wa wajiristi tutume maapostles. Hey ay 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 ay. If you nominate to have that, pokea hiyo grace. Pokea hiyo grace. Pokea hiyo grace. the man of god i took her from judah to madui rehoboam na jeroboam they were enemies but wakati mungu aliongea i don't go for this man of god haku complain god bona unanituma si ukituma mtu wa bethel wakati aliibua na mungu aende aliopi angalia mweza kumwambia tii kile mungu anasema ile problem tuko nayo tunapendanga kusikia vile Mungu sisi tunataka aoke. Wasi vile Mungu anaongea, you see? Mimi ni ajuanga unajua watu wanakuja hapa Tuesday na Fridays. Kuna vile amekuja mimi nataka nataka pasta muongee hii uniambie pasta nataka pasta hii area hii area. Wakati utaguza hiyo area pasta ni hapo. <laughs> hapo pasta ni hapo this man of god from judah to bethel then how much is manake tell you just one minute before uketi babu nasema kwa wakati alienda mahali pale alienda na kaenda mahali jeroboam alikuwa jeroboam alikuwa ni mfalme na jeroboam now the problem of jeroboam ni kuja alikuwa amejenga alikuwa amejenga demonic order yeye ni alikuwa mfalme but instead of kuongoza watu wajenge a godly order yeye kama mfalme aliongoza watu kutenga demonic order akatenga moja dan na ingine pete and i pray ya kwamba wale viongozi baba atatupea ni viongozi watatuongoza kujenga godly order but not a demonic order if when mzazi nisikize ongoza watoto wako kujenga madhabahu mazuri lakini si madhabahu mabaya usijenge madhabahu ya pombe na unacomplain watoto wanakunywa pombe na ni wewe ulijenga madhabahu ya pombe usioe bibi wa tano alafu na complain mtoto wako akilita wa pili na hajifika leva yako Just a thing is a nota Jeroboam was a king na kajenga demonic order better na dan I repeat the move to heaven I intervene. I don't know that is why to make a prophetic Sunday. Na kwa sababu kuna mambo Mungu lazima akaitafine. Kuna shughuli zake ni lazima Mungu akaitafine. Mungu alitoa man of God. Aliona mfalme amekosea, amejenga ota hafai kujenga na nahitaji prophetic grace. Na kataba mtu ambaye na prophetic voice aenda ka address issue. Maana it comes a time baba inaona ananinua mapaka manabii wamebeba grace on the is a good bit of work. Father was a prophet, man of God. A man to the king. Na king na maskari. Lakini haya haogopi maskari. Manake as long as you carry go. We don't say your enemies. I will try to be a a. You go by the word of God. Man of God alienda. But they ebu get just one minute. Somebody you some you one minute. Ebu just one minute before get. Ebu some you in a smaji. And of some kama mtu ambaye amechoka. Imagine ota ile amejenga yake. Alizuilia watu wende Jerusalem. Mahali palikuwa na burning water ya Mungu. Then akawatengenezea ota, akatenga mwezi wa kuabudu na akatengeneza priest wake. Akapanda priest wake na kubaibu. Priest walikuwa wakwendo wana baba mainua. So kila mtu alikuwa anafaa kuitwa priest. Ili uitu a priest alisi mungu toka from the house of Aaron. Ili kuwa priest. But here kaji tengeleze a priest wake. Let me tell you. Hakuna kitu kimbaya. Kama watombo wa mepado na binadamu. Na si mungu wa mewapanda. Hawaendi mbali. 
So he akaenda kwa that altar. Bwana sema kwa wakat man of God prophet amekuja. Alikuta kama Jeroboam ako pale kwa pale altar. Then ana offer a no offering. Offering anaitwa wapi? Kwa demonic order. Agana mwenza kumwambia I pray for you. Usoi tu pesa zako. Kwa demonic order. Mwambie tu tena mwambie usoi pesa tu pesa zako. Kwa demonic order. Let me tell you what. Mimi napendanga sana kusaidia. Sana. Sada. Na napendanga sana kupea watu kwa barabara bao wanaweko huko. Bali sipiane sipei kila mtu kwa sababu ameweka kwa barabara. Spirit yangu kilikataza huwa nakataa. Na nimebeba kuna time tulio agent mmoja akisema kwamba sometimes wanaingia wale watu. Ili wa manipulate your money ukiweka mahali pale na ni spirit iko na agenda inachukua hiyo pesa kuanzia hapo unaisha unakuwa maskini wewe unafikiria kwa ya 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 in fact nakumbuka agent mmoja tulimwambia kaniambia kwamba alikuwa amepoa assignment ile baadhi tulimwambia kwamba alikuwa ametoa pesa huko alikuwa anatoa dhahabu moja hapa kitoa hapo mko na chomo alafu inakuwa pesa nomo alafu anaenda kununua akinunua ifu nauza banana za au mahindi akinunua serious kwako inaisha as long as they may na hiyo pesa so jeroboam alikuwa ameenda kwa that order na alikuwa anatoa offering to that order and that order was a demonic order so si kila mtu unafaa kutoa pesa zako na si kila mtu unafaa kutolea pesa zako kwa sababu unasikia kiubiri na si kila mtu unafaa kuconnect na yeye kwa sababu you may share you may partake from that order kuna time paul aliandikia wa korinto akisema kwamba if you commune now from that order you partake from that altar so the altar you connect with now should partake from that altar kasa thing so jiroboam ako hapa there is one any refreshment who your mama bailed kwa natoa testimony ni ni hiyo hati alikuwa nayo alisema kwamba ati anataka anataka ati anunulie pastor sahani and and struggle to at pata pesa ya sahani anunulie pastor sahani Alafu kanisitoa sana Tuesday akija na sahani nne hata sina karatasi zimewekwa. Sababu hana pesa mpaka kununua karatasi. Akaja na sahani nne amezishika hivi, pasa ni mavuta sahani hizi huo unatumia. I like that faith. Lazima kwa pasa nataka kununua 12 dasa ni mzima, lakini siwezi kwa sababu sina pesa mzima nimekuja na nne, zile naweza pata. Na sana nikastuka sana kwa sababu zile nne hata si haripata ni kupewa lipewa wakati ni mwambie kwa basarimia watu ambao miba zinatoka kama vile zake ziko zinatoka then akasarimia watu kadhaa watu ambao wanajua vile wanafaa ku connect na grace ah! wakati kama huyu mama ambaye ametoka miba 14 siwezi so, kumsarimia just the dad so wale wa mama walikuwa namsarimia na kitu tangaza vizuri tangaza vizuri nataka nataka unisikize hapa nataka tuelewane vizuri sana imagine walikuwa namsarimia na kitu ili miba zisitoke kama zake vile ziko zinatoka And immediately let me tell you mama instead ya kutumia zile pesa akanunua sahani ya kareta na amepewa badala ya tumie na ana pesa nanunua sahani hiyo ni ile imani inakuza nini hapo ni pale Yesu anasema kwamba huyu huyu dia ametoa mingi niangalie mama nikamwangalia tena nikamwangalia tena kasi ndio kai yani mama badala nunuli hawa watoto hata kuo ameleta sahani ile kwa wota kwa bia god thank you kwa kile Mungu ametenda sasa nilikuwa na 1500 za mjengo nikamwambia chukua 1500 za mjengo hata sikutaka kujua kana kwa za mjengo si za mjengo chukua nikapeana hiyo ndio problem ya kupea mtu pesa hata peana hizo kamwambia chukua enda nazo enda tu nunulia hawa watoto suti so zero bomb alikuwa anatoa sack offering kwa a demonic order hii ndio problem ya nistua Watu mbona naamini mambo ya kishetani? Wanaweza toa pesa kwa demonic order. Lakini watu mbona naamini Mungu? Wanangangana na kutoa 50 bob order. 50. Wana struggle. Ka 50 anakakuja hivi, anakakuja hivi, anakakuja hivi, anakakuja hivi, anakakuja hivi, alafu anachagulia kwa mfuko. Na kuambia kwamba ukichagua hivi utakuwa na kwama, una kwama na kwa elfu. Hiyo inapita. Na kwamba baba na chukua mtamata elfu. Ukitaka kuweka 50 unaweka elfu moja. Praise God what about tunachagua sana pesa ya ofari. 
Mwanzi ni kweli basi unakuta kubwa mtu anakachagua unaka 15 unajua vile ulipaka kwa mfuko so ka 50 kako number 1 ka 100 ka 200 alafu kwa bahati nzuri roho mtakatifu anakuongoza unakosa kujiongoza me alikuwa ameenda kwa ota kutua offering kwa ota na ni mbaya i pray for you watoto wako hawatatoa pesa kwa ota mbaya i pray for you bwanako hatapeleka pesa zake kwa ota mbaya i pray for you for so brother and your sister hatapeleka pesa zake kwa ota mbaya in the name of jesus hatakuwa na kamata pesa anapeleka kwa pombe Shiroboam alikuwa mahali pale. I thank God for this man. Wakati alifika mahali mfano alikuwa, hakutarika na kwamba ni mfano na kona maskari. Yeye alienda na akaangalia ota. Angalia verse number 2 alafu keti. Angalia verse number 2 alafu nikupea time. Hebu angalia verse 2 nataka hii ya mwisho. Angalia Bible inasemaje 1 2 3. Angalia inasemaje. Goja goja ameenda wapi? Ameenda Bethel si ndio? Mahali Shiroboam ametenga ota na akakutana na mwenye ota. <laughs> Akakutana na mwenye kujenga ota. Na ni mfalme. Angalia mwanzo akimwambia hakumsalimia. Hakukuwa na time ya salamu. Hebu msalimia. Alienda na mfalme yuko pale, hakumsalimia. Kaenda tena kaenda. Hebu <laughs> ongea na yeye. Eh. Yeye anajiandaa kutoa offering mahali pale. Then this man of God, ambaye amebeba Mungu. Ah, amebeba grace ya unabii. Amebeba mafuta ya that time. Bibi nasema kwamba akaenda kaangalia that ota ona vile merebesho vile metengenezo tena kangali that ota kasa hao kana kwamba kuna mfalme mfalme tutasalimiana after this after nimemaliza my assignment then to salimiane but before nimaliza my assignment hakuna salamu the time has come to bury na chochote shetani amepanda kwa familia zetu the time has come and now the pombe to bury in the name of jesus musai tana meeting Nakuta kwamba kuna brana lazima kuja kuwa mrevi. Hata mkiitana na kuja kuwa mrevi. Na nafika kwa mwisho, alafu analeta fujo wakati mnaendelea na hiyo hizo. Na analeta vitugo. Angalia mwanzo kumwambia mambo kama haya. Wakati umefika, tuende mpaka mahali hiyo ota imekaa. Tunene that ota. Tuseme from today. Hatutaitana meetings. Alafu kama wewe unakuja kuwa mrevi, wainaina anakuja kuwa mrevi, we can't for that in the name of Jesus kuja hivyo hana mkitana alafu unakuta kwamba hawa wengine ndio wazimesimama bali unakuta kwamba ya ya nyakio haisimamangi nasikupenda kwa gaji wagi na anapatanga sana unajua kuna watu ambao wanapata sana the problem is kupata the problem ni ku kuna unajua kuna mtu ambaye hapati anaweza maintain bali kuna mtu ambaye ni problem ni ku maintain So man of God alienda hakusalimia msafarme akati kwa mfano wa mainua demonic order here akaenda ka cry against that order when he said oh water oh water akaanza kuongea na water and he was going to be water who was in askia mambo ya water zina masikio mimi nataka ninene na watu ambao wako mahali hapa the time has come water sote za umaskini to finish from now to be oh water oh water hear the word of the lord hatutakaliwa na umaskini water inafuria tutenge water tupeka biashara zina kwama water zinafuria watoto wetu wafanikiwe na waachiliwe wanatukana watu bila kujua 
sababu kuna madhabahu yanaongea hakuna mwezi akomwambie madhabahu yote ya kansa anga the man of god alienda akasema kwamba madhabahu hii ya this akaenda madhabahu hii ya this akasema kwamba asan angalia mwezi akomwambie asan angalia mwezi akomwambie asan mwambie not child mwambie asan ah akasema kwamba angalia ndipo kwamba asan ni mdosaya be born to the house of david so akamwambia kwamba kuna asan hakuna mwezi akomwambie the time has come for sons to manifest i know you know what i'm saying the time has come for sons to manifest manaka there are some dimensions i will end unless you grow to a level of a son upoke level ya mtoto pale nilisema kwamba wakati nilikuwa mtoto nilikuwa nafikiria kama mtoto nilikuwa naogea kama mtoto there are some dimensions that i had to grow hata ukimwagiliwa mafuta ya chupa yote ile ya pembe Jana idango for my act bishop. Tupoenda kwa anoint referred alipoenda kwa anoint referred some. Akuwe bishop jana alibeba pembe. Oh god. Bibi yake alichomoa na kusema oh Jesus Christ. Hii mpaka kuna shida hiyo pembe si ni mwaki pe bwana. Eh akachukua pembe. Oh my god. Before mu complain alitumia pembe. No. <laughs> Before mwanzo kuna be on the pembe imetoka nini or then ku complain is my ak bishop litumia pembe na akitumia naweza itumia so akachukua pembe mahali pa kaiweka mafuta so akaimwagilia oh god tunaelewana tunaelewana mahali hapa thank you thank you able to sum your verse to make you hapo alafu nikupeta mimi ya kuketi inasemaje kwanza fikisha hapo hata ikiwa ni mulidhi na wewe bado ni mtoto hauna tofauti na so that's why wakati man of god alienda kana naye hota aliambia hota yule ambaye atadili na wewe ni san kuna zaliwa san hakusema chaun maana kama sometimes inafika church that's why teachings are very important maana kama zinakusaidia ku grow na kujua who you are and the authority that you carry Manek and lazy you realize that authority you may miss a mark. So I remember come son ni son ambaye atakuja ku deal. Angalia a son named Josiah. Oh God. Josiah means the fire of Jehovah. Or whom Jehovah chooses. You are the chosen one. You are the called one. Angalia mwezako mwambie you are the Josiah from the house of david from the house of the beloved jesus christ is our beloved we are from the house of david the house of the beloved who is that to say someone to say now on sari kosha tazaliwa akuje now one minute and afuke tangalia hii on you he will sacrifice priest of the high priests ya mwisho uketi angalia hii uketi bwana angalia uketi nao angalia hii uketi angalia hii uketi hii nataka utangaze vizuri sana so ameenda maendeleo ya nini ota agree mwezako mbi after this kuna otas tunanenea ota za kifo tunazinenea ota za ndoto mbaya ota zinakunywa damu kwenu ota lazima watu kwenu wafanye operations i hate operations i hate them kwa sababu ma wakati mwingine shetani zikile zinakuanga demonic shetani anataka tudamu imwakwe ili ajie mpawe na that sacrifice man of god alienda akananea that order akisema kwamba there is a child ambaye anazali sana ambaye anazaliwa huyu sana anaitwa Josiah na unoe that promise it was 340 years before Josiah azaliwe na kaito mpaka jina yake 340 years before azaliwe takuja sasa wale kuhani wanatoa sacrifice hapa hata kuulia mahali pale ananenea hota na anaiambia anaambia hota hota nisikize hiyo wadike but hii ndio nataka alafu keti alafu akasema kwamba but this is a sign nataka usome hii alafu tukimaliza uketi tukisimaliza verse 3 uniachie verse number 4 utakuwa umeketi but some of us number 3 tulikuwa umesimama tusome inasemaje nataka usome hiyo vizuri sana that man of god time alitumwa that same day hebu soma tena Sija kusikia. Sija sikia vizuri. 
Angalia mwanza kumwambia that same day is today. Mwambie that same day is today. Alisema kwamba that same day the man of God gave a sign and I want to be clear after this may you receive a sign <laughs> a confirmation that there is a promotion coming a confirmation that there is a lot that has been broken a confirmation that there is connections that are coming Ebu ngali nasemaje that same day the man of God gave a sign akasemaje this is the sign that the Lord has declared the the, the, the altar ni altar gani na spirit ile altar ambayo ilikuwa imetengenezwa the man of god akasema wewe altar nimekrea against you hii ndio sign yakoba lazima altar of unchike the altar will be spread apart and ashes on it will be angalia mwanzo kama bia today kuna altar zina spirit <laughs> kuna altar za magodi zina spirit kuna altar za dress zina spirit kuna altar za shoes zina spirit kuna altar za machari zina spirit kuna unahitaji mafuta na hata gari unahitaji sitaki hii gereza tikuwe na mafuta na hauna pesa agree mwanza kumwambie mafuta na pesa bado zinaingiana ha si bado zinaingiana unakuta kwa zinakuweka vizuri zina zina flow zina rhythm actually zina zina nini vizuri eh zina nini vizuri eh angalia mwanza kama bibi ni vibaya ukue na mafuta alafu mafuta hauna pesa ah nasema kwa angalia mwanza kama bibi it is biblical ukue na mafuta na flat kadhaa unakodisha <laughs> nasema kwamba it is the miracle kuwa na mafuta na shamba kadhaa umenunua hey! it is good kuwa na mafuta na at least at least uwe na matatu kadhaa kwa barabara and i declare from today hapa kuwa tu na mafuta paka mfuko uba na hiyo ota inazuilia mfuko ukue na kitu <laughs> me that out of spirit now i say me that out of spirit so watch it get now watch it get in kuonyesha kitu watch it get now watch it get now alafu angalia mwanzo kumwambia kuna madhabahu yanavujika sasa angalia mwanzo kumwambia vile umeketi kuna madhabahu yamenyamaza forever hey i say in the name of jesus kuna madhabahu yameongea against you but after this so when this man of god alinelea that altar water water hear the word of the lord alisema kwamba Josiah a son from the house of David atazaliwa na kile ambacho atafanya akisema kwamba there is a sign to date onyeshwa then kuna kitu ambacho aliongea alisema hivi nisikize kwamba hiyo water ita spirit then Jeroboam alikuwa mahali pale na askari akashindwa why this man anacheza na mimi anajua mimi ni mfalme ota yake akasikia kwamba itavujika Jeroboam alinyosha mkono akasema kwamba arrest that arrest that man shika huyo mtu I believe alikuwa anasema hako kana jifanya kama nabii kashike mfano akanyosha mkono read your bible hebu soma verse number 4 alafu nikuonyeshe kitu verse number 4 soma 1 2 kwa haraka tusome 1 2 3 ehe si jaskia tena is good to realize angalia mwanzo kumwambia ukianza kudi na orders kuna counter attacks 
And that's why today nataka nikuonyesha how to deal with those counter attacks. Wakati ume silence order, wakati umeamua umeamua kuombea mzee mpaka aokoke. Wakati umeamua umeamua kuombea watoto mpaka ufanikiwe. Wakati umeamua kuombea your business to deal with anything ambayo inakalia your business. They are counter attacks. Jeroboam wakati alisikia alisema kwamba kamata. Wacha nitangaze hivi. If kuna maneno kwenye rumongo kilo hametolewa Yakoba ushikwe Au biyashara yako ikamatwe If kuna any spirit Inajaribu kukuarest We declare before you kukuarest Tumeireta tunia migu yetu In the name of Jesus Boi nasema koba haka point mkono Let me just clear this enough to endele Inu mkono wako sema katika jina rais kurisu Mikono yote Ime winuluwa against me Mikono ya magojwa yote ya kukataliwa ah tangaza hiyo mikono wacha ikaoka in the name of jesus ebu nisikize ebu ebu angalia ebu soma tena soma mungu nasemaje so let me ask you let me ask you something ni nini man of god alifanya ili mkono uwithe nini alifanya na huyu man of god ambaye alipointiwa na mfalme nini alifanya ili mkono ukauke bible imesema alifanya nini kuna kitu alifanya alioba alienda fasting alienda kuita intercessors nini alifanya aliambia mfalme don't point me He had point two to hivo. Then what happened? So I did pigania vita. Nani alikuwa amemtuma? Agari mwanzo kama bi yule ambaye amekutuma. Mikono ingine ndiye atashughulikia. That's it. That I come yeah. Agari mwanzo kama bi ile grace umebeba. Haitabishana na watu wengine. Wacha ko point. But yule ambaye amekuenoa, yule ambaye amekutuma, he is the one to be with that kuongea hata hakusema ikauke aa ilifanya tu hata alisuka hivi haya haya ni nini and i brief me person na sio mkono tu likauka mpaka maskari ambao alikuwa anambia arrest i brief for the jaribu akakaa tu hivyo ni yeye bwa tu sita hii sahau siku moja Mungu alikausha mtu nikijionea sita hii sahau nilikuwa na marafiki wangu alikuwa ananiambia kwamba alikausha mbwa so nilikuwa natamani siku moja nikikaushe Oh dia da dot to do. Mama moja akafungulia mbwa. Kasema kwa mtaingia huko si watobo tumeenda dot to do. Bonus if say we da dot to do nifanye hivi. Angalia mwanza kumwambia after kumaliza kujenga church. Ile evangelism tunafanya hujaiona. Ile moja tunafanya hujaiona. If haujaienda dot to do tafadhali after kumaliza kujenga jatu tumemaliza by the manake this 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 month tunaingia 20 20 yeah 24 the tuna grad opening ya kanisa so you do time to the shift kwa baraka kanisani mahari kwetu 24 so we have only three sundays have only three sundays then tunaenda mahari pale so after that nakwambia zile mission tutafanya tutalipua hii anga ya dandora tutazunguka kiambu ene ota lazima tutainenea so hao walienda mama kaachilia mbwa akasema kwa hey shika hao <laughs> sasa wale brothers ni wale brothers hao hopi eh si unajua wale brothers hao wanaendaga evangelism ni wale brothers kwanza wale wa mioto brother wa mioto <laughs> baada wakaambia kwa wewe mbwa <laughs> so by the way the court you understand kuna ile verse eh in the book of exodus Mungu anasema kwamba wana wa Israeli hakuna umbo ambaye atabweka kwao. Kwa sababu kwamba hakuna umbo ambaye inafaa kuongea kwa sisi. Wewe kauka. Umbo ilijirusha tu juu hivi. Karudi kwa mekauka. Huyo mama time aliona hivyo. Alisema hata before kuhubiriwe aokoke. <laughs> umbo yake imekaushwa. <laughs> So what can I get that oh my god sick what is in nikaushe Akini mwanza kumwambia but 
Ni vyema sana u understand huyu amebeba hiyo grace but we hauna that grace. Umekuwa grace maybe na side nyingine. Mimi nakumbuka tu time moja tulikausha mama mchao. Tulimkausha. <laughs> Lakini hata sio sisi. Ni vile alitusumbua. Anaroga mtoto wake na mtoa sacrifice. Nilimwambia mtoto alikuwa na ananyonywa damu na kufa ameisha nataka kukufa. Afu umekuja miokoka kwa kanisa. Tukajua kwake kuna majini. Kamwambia kwamba tunaenda na the problem was si tulikuwa wakali ni kwa ni ujirist kabisa serious. So majini ni ya mamake. Nasema kwa tunakuja huko. Tukaenda. <laughs> Tukaenda mpaka huko. Tukaingia kwa room na room alikuwa amepoa na mamake. Tukaingia acha tuanze kuraka baba ushatatana alafu hiyo si mambo haikuwa na disika mambo ya town unajua mambo ya town na discipline kwa sababu nyumba za town kuna vile hawezi piga nduru kwa sababu una nini sasa kule unajua hakuna issue unaweza piga nduru sana so father bako take it boko sharipa ka father with clear fire with clear fire akasikia mahali alikuwa mama kaja katuambia kwa bonani amemtuma sasa tuko tumefunga mlango kwa sababu tulikuwa tunajua kwamba kuna za haribika anytime akafungu ria mbwa alafu akaja kwa dirisha hadi dirisha mahali ilikuwa sasa akaja kupiga uu, 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 kwa dirisha wakati tunaomba na sisi tukafunga masikio shata ta ta pa kata wewe endelea kupiga nduru mami hey hawa wamekuja nitaita maskari nikafungua macho nikamwambia mami niko na niko, niko na simu nikusaidie kupiga maskari wakuje <laughs> mama akapiga nduru by the way akasema kwamba akaleta fujo No the more to go to naomba let me tell you another one is kizi hata fujo sana akasema kwamba acha nini na mtoto wangu akasema kwamba tunatoka hapa akipona hatoki tunatoka hata kufa huyu hata pona na ile dhabihu ametolewa tunavunja hiyo sacrifice tunaihandle water hiyo water tunaendelea one on one oh water oh, water hear the voice of the lord <laughs> mama wacha nikwambie the more alikuwa anaongea mama alikuwa makwadrisha hivi kanyamaza na kaweka mkono hivi na kashindwa kawa natangalia hivi mpaka tukasema amen kamlisi tukusaidie maskari uliwe wako hapo nje tutoke tuone maskari mama ongee mama alitoka tu pole pole na akaenda kuanzia hapo akatuita sisi ni wachawi na zone time niliona mama amekauka alikuja kuzuri ya huyo brother ako hai mpaka wale na hakufa maana kama dhabahu yake yalisha nguvu angeli mwanza kumwambia today ende ote inavuria biashara yako lazima ifunjike in the name of jesus angeli mwanza kumwambia kama unamwambia hai mwambie you're sitting close to a millionaire hey shataka bagote kaya nani alisema kumbe utakufa hivyo no nasema Jeroboam akasema arrest ule mkono uko kauka. The man of God hako anashuhudika na mkono. Hako anashuhudika na kwamba maskari watakuja. Jeroboam kwamba si nimetumwa hapa. Si jajituma. Shuria bea amenituma ata handle issue zingine. But now listen to this. Mark verse number 5. Nataka nikupe mambo mawili alafu tuombe. Mimi sitaki kuweka hapa. I'm true now. Hebu soma 1 2 Soma vizuri sana hapo 1 2 Goja. Kine man of God alisema kilitendeka. Vile alisema kwamba ota itavujika ilivujika. Angeli mwenza kumwambia after this service kuna ota zilikuwa zinaongea against watu wa kwenu. Hazitawayongea tena in the name of Jesus. Wenda zilikuwa zinaongea against mtoto. Wenda zilikuwa zinaongea against wewe. Wenda zilikuwa zinaongea against mwanako. Hazitawai alisema kwamba wote itavujika na ikavujika ilivujika Jeroboam akiwa na Jionea kwanza spirit evil na kwanza yeye mwenyewe mkono umekauka hivi hebu hebu soma verse number 4 again soma verse number 4 again hiyo kwanza nikuonyeshe ehe imagine mkono umekauka alafu madhabahu ime spirit kushika jeroboam akiwa anajiangalia jeroboam remember 
ni ye mwenye dhatu ota ni ye ni jenga dhatu ota but kile kina nitenga is verse number ambo ebu angari verse verse number 4 verse number 4 inasimaji nataka mpaka kuingia nataka mpaka kuingia eh wangapo anaamini akoba ni Mungu na wapigania vita angalia mweza kumwambia usijipigania vita ni Mungu anakupigania vita so then angalia verse number 6 now look at the verse number 6 now and don't miss this one bible nasemaje soma that one so there Wale I like the grace about you know this man of God. Kandi wengine wetu. Kaa kaa hivyo wewe. Kaa kaa hivyo. Kwanza wageenda man of God hakuwa na issue huyu man of God. Ameona mkono wa mfalme umekauka. Alafu mfalme amenyenyekea. I like how God is merciful. Yaani yeye hakuwa anataka kuwagamiza Jerusalem. The heart of God ni watu ambaye waokoke. The heart of God is not to destroy them. The heart of God is to bring them to the kingdom. That's why wakati mkono ulikauka, then akamwambia intercede, niombe tu mkono ukue restored. The this is the time now man of God akaomba, then muujizo ukatendeka. Angalia mweza kumwambia after this kuna grace inaanguka kwa hako watu ambao walikuwa against you watahitaji maombi yako in Jesus mighty name you don't know what i'm saying now kuna watu ambao wanakuwa na kunyokea after kuona vile baba amekutetea you look after you i don't know who am i prophesying today kuna watu ambao wanakuwa na kiafya wanakuwa na kiafya kibiashara bado kuna wakati watakuta ungeambia mfalme kuna time anahitaji huyu prophet alikuwa anasema arrest Yaani mtu ambaye anasema arrest instead of arresting yeye anaji arrest anaji arrest mkono Alafu not only that anaambia man of God man of God Angalia mwanzo kumwambia mgonga imwambia wanakuja Mwambie wakija mwambie wakija Usijifanye mgumu usijifanye mgumu usijifanye mgumu Ati ni nini ulikuwa unaniuliza Calm down calm down forgive them si wameona mguu wako ni nini tu kwa tunataka i know kuna watu ambao walichofanya hivyo siku moja but I ask them kwanza walikuja kutotafuta na bahasha kubwa sana walikuwa wamesema watutakufa wakatufukuza wakaja na bahasha kwanza walikuja mpaka kwa nyumba akasema kwamba tumeona Mungu amemuonekania sana tuobe baraka na kwa mimi ni speaking tongues Hey, shakofa karaba kofa. Fada kushi una release, na release pale. Kwanza hapo ni release mzuri sana. Kwanza akapiga nduru sita nikashukuru Bwana. <laughs> Unaitu kuna issue zingine huyu mtu ni ile tu ya huyu man of God hakuwa na issue. But says how watu walitufinya, wakatufinyia, wakatupokonya mali yetu. Haoni kana kwamba wao wataisha. But one day wakaona kwamba kuna Mungu wakaja so this man of god jeroboam mfalme alipoint kidole akanyosha angalia mwezangu babi kuna watu watanyosha vidole vyao kwako kuna watu watanyosha kwa watoto wanasema hawatasoma wana arrest mawazo yao wana arrest mpaka destiny zao but god is fighting your battles i say god is fighting your battles Let me declare this bit of woga. I know kuna watu watakufuta. Kuna watu walikudharao. Watahitaji uwakopeshe mpaka pesa. Hebu angalia verse number 7. Angalia verse number 7 then alafu nikupe mambo matano tumalize. Nakwambia watu wengi wage back slide hapo. Watu wengi hapo wage back slide hapa. Angalia mwezo kumwambia verse 7. Mwambie ungepita hiyo. Kwanza ujue ni man of God na hana kagari. Na angetoka mbibi kwa gari na unajua ameponya mfalme. Sasa kuongea juu ya mtu ambaye aliombea bibi ya mtu mkubwa. Sasa kusema ni nani? Alikuwa mgojwa. 
Habibu wa president mfrani alikuwa tu wa Kenya sitaki kusema ni mgani akamwombea na kumwambia huyo pastor from there alipoenda kwa nyumba ya mfalme chochote alikuwa anataka kapewa alimwombea wakati mguu ulikuwa ni nini mguu ulikuwa mbaya akamwambia ukapona hapo babu anasema kwamba mfalme akamwambia kuja kwa nyumba tuende tukakule alafu ene temu na kula na watu unajiingiza kwenye covenant si kila gift unafaa kuipokea gift zingine ziko demonic ile chini ile ndio ile ndio pile chini kwa hapa kuna chini kwa mahali hapa mamia ileta hapa mtu ambaye alikuja na kapea chini mtoto wa shule by the way na ilikuja hapa nikaiombea ilikuwa hapa on tuesday alipopoa that chain from there akaanguka na akaanza kuojeka ni chain tu alipewa ilibidi niletee hiyo chain on tuesday hapa kaiombea hapa maana kile ya some chains kuna brother niletewa aliingizwa kama agent wakati alipoa chain na bracelet akaivaa mfanye hapa anaambia man of god twende kwa nyumba tukakule pale alafu nikupe gift na hapa ndipo watu wanangangania wito na president if watu wanangangana tu waende occasion mahari president ako if unaweza miss kanisa kwa sababu hawa ah, wanagobea nini anapita hapa mc anapita hapa nje umistaji upewe 100 bob haiwezi kusaidia 100 kwa za 100 squeeze na nunua mpaka unga. Angalia mwezo kumwambia kwanza kupoa 200 ni kudharauliwa. Angalia mwezo kumwambia level yako sio kupoa 200 kwa barabara. You need the grace of God upon you. With that grace you can go and do business and earn a lot of money. You don't need to be given 200. Hazi. Na nitasema tena ni vibaya sana mtu ambaye ameokoka unaruka unatoka kwa roli na huku kwa barabara hivi tunakuona unachomoka kwa roli na kitishat kimeandikwa hapa si at least utafute t-shirt imeandikwa Jesus is the way na wendo kwa the gospel no no kutoka haja wewe ivaa t-shirt kama hiyo ya mambo ya Mungu but ana t-shirt ya siasa na ameokoka anashuka kwa roli hivi anatoka na 500 mbona unadharau Mungu wetu serious Pastor unataka kusema namna gani? Eh nataka kusema kwamba hauhitaji kupewa 500 uchague mtu. I tell you the truth. Hata mtu akija hapa asikia kwamba kuna kuna tunafungua unajua kuna watu kifungua pale church grand opening. Watu wa siasa wanaweza pita hapo. Hata akitoa pesa hapo hatutamchagua. Are we together? As long as Mungu hajaweka huo mzigo tu uchague yeye. Hata mo thank you atakuja tukiselebrate tunafungua jazi tukijenga. Thank God hiyo kanisa tumejenga hakuna shiriki hata moja ya mwana siasa. Hata moja hata 10 bob. Hata 10 bob. So ameito na kakata. It is my prayer. Mungu kusaidie invitation zikini unakataa. So wacha nimalize kwa haraka. Hebu angalia verse alafu nimalize nikupe kwa haraka sana. Then soma hiyo tu alafu nikuonyeshe nimalize. Eh. Eh. Amekubali amekataa. Next verse. Ah, anamwambiaje? I was commanded by the word of God you must not or drink or return by the way you Na God I wish kuna watu ambao watasimama na kile Mungu amesema Ha? Ha? Na bosi akikwambia atakupea nini kuna kuna i tu 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 nini stack tuna tuna kwa tuna trade hii watu wana kama tango hivyo wanauliza tu kaswali nilikutana na kamoja hivyo kaka nisitua akauliza sasa wewe mwenyewe hotivu umepewa 2 million dollars 
Can you release your man for two million dollars for one week? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And as I'm release for one week, I end it. Can you release your man for two million dollars? Two million dollars for one week. Only one week. One week only. Two million dollars. Uh, 200 million. Thank you. 200 million. Upewe 200 million. Ulilisi bwanako kwanza aede na mtu mgini for one week alafu akurudie for. Eh? Adi? Adi? Jesus Christ. Eh? 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 Adi? 200. Unashito 200. Adi wikini wakipo hata 1 million. Iyo meisha. Atika na ya wani ya. Wekini, wekini, wekini wakipo wani minu. Ka na ya ni mekupea. Hata meni zubua sana. Ka na ya kwa za wani ya. Uzuburu ya vile ni mesuburu wa rafu ni rudishie. Ebu soma. Ebu soma hii vazi. Vasa nama ten. Nataka tisome yote. Atisome hapa alafu ni kwenyeshe. Now, hapa nipo nataka he. Nataka tu hapo kwa haraka sana. Nataka tisome hapo alafu. Ni high rate kwa haraka bila kwa explain. Ili tuingie kwa maombi. Wakati kuna counter tax. Nataka unusikize. Si man of God amedri na ota. Ambo yuko wapi? Bethel. Imevunchika hai kufunchika. Amekubari kile mbato umebuona ki. Amekata. But kuna mahali ya refill. Na that prophet died the same day. Although memutumiwa na mungu sana. Although mungu memutumia sana. Although mekata konfarme. Alitakanyo wa hapa. Na kafil. And I believe personally. This was a counter attack of the devil. Wakati shetani lichukoba mevunja madabahu yangu. Akachoko ba nita manipretu mtu ambaye hawazi fikiria na heza kuwa manipretu. Manake wakati mgini shetani natumia watu ambao hawazi fikiria kuwa ma ni shetani. Now this is. Na nikwenyesha how to win this battle. Kwa haraka sana. Wakati kuna counter attacks. Angalia ina simaji. Now there was a certain living. So now the question is, if there was a prophet in Bethel, why was this prophet in a comfort zone? Kwa nini ya likuwa nakubari? Ya kumba madabahu ya jengo in Bethel. Na he was a prophet in Bethel. Na hakuwa naungea. Hakuwa na address that order. Kwa nini mungu haku mtumia, meaning alikuwa me compromise. Alikuwa in phrase that, na that order. Amo alikuwa in Bethel. That's where hangi okay against that altar. There was a known prophet. Babu ina muita kwanza old. Amezoea. Kutabiri mpaka na hitu amezekea kwa unabi. Na hakuna kitu kimbaya kama wala wanabi waze. Sisemi kuzeka nini ye. Utabuwa nasema koba nimekua ni kitumeo na mungu for 10 years hata mimi. Kwanza nimekua muibaji for 15 years. Nini muna tobe nini mekuja another day. Mi ni meimba for 30 years. Manabi waze, wala waze. Angari vile babu inasema, inasema haji? Who sons and told him all? Hata alikuwa shuguri, haku disan, there's another prophet anakuja, alikuwa shuguri. Yani, mungu alikuja kudimanifest kwao, na ya meenda. Hatuji alikuwa wapi? Alikuja kuwabiwa na watoto, watoto walishuhudia. Meaning watu walisikia kiri kilifanyika. Watoto wakata kushuhudia. Wakasikia kuba kiri kimetendeka. They also told their father what he had said to the king. Watoto wa huyo mnabi mse walijua. Wakamuambia te walikuja. Then angalia what happened. Narafu ni kwenyeshi kwa haraka sana. Angalia. Naraka unisikize one. Ina nisuwaga sana. Their father. Ehe. Which way? Ba ina nisitua. Watoto waliangalia. Wakajua mpaka ile jia mepiti. Angeli ya mwezaka mwambie, chunga ile jia huwa napitia. Kuna watu huwa nakuona, hata tayi mufikiri watu wana. Man of God hage jua ile jia mepitia, kuna mtu wana muona. Batu watoto wana biwa nukuja kisema kopa, walionishana ile jia mepitia. Na sometimes watch ile jia unapitia. Kuna watu wana kuona bila kujua. Watasema na huwa naedaga. Sia na kunyuanga. Anaigianga room number. Wana kujua na ile jiu napitia. 
Walionyeshana ile jia. Alipitia. Sio kwa haraka sana angalia ehe. Kwa haraka sana. I have only five minutes ehe. Ehe. So alianza alifuata nionyeshe kachukua nao punda akafuata nabii nao madis ehe Are you Ehe Angani mwanza kumwambia usikue mtu wa haraka kujibu maswali mengine kwanza relax Anaziri yomo eh ni mimi ni nini sasa Take time Takuje kwa nini nakuuliza usijibu kwa haraka. So here now are you that man of God? Hata Jesus Christ alimwelekea kutafuta hakuogea mara ya kwanza. Sasa yeye anaulizwa kwa haraka, yeye ni mimi. I am, ni mimi sasa. Anaulizwa. Tena angalia, hebu angalia, hebu angalia look at this. So now wacha tuulizane sorry before tumalize. Nani ametuma huyu nabii afuate yule na man of God? Wacha tuongee. Nani amemtuma? Eh? Na nani amemtuma? Eh wacha tuongee ukweli. Nani ametuma the old prophet? Wacha tuulize. Ametuma na Mungu? Amejituma? Are you sure? Aisha amejitoa kwa nyumba anafuata the true prophet kwa barabara just like that Lazima kuwa kuna spirit in a moon friends Lazima kuwa kuna roho inaomposha fanya kile ambacho anafanya I believe the demonic orders ambazo zote zinatawala that area I believe the principalities of heaven I believe demons of mahali pale very man of God man of God very people of Jehovah ya kwamba that man of God ametoshurekea ame break the water now to assignment mzuri amekuja na demonic assignment hebu ujue kwamba ni shetani anamwambiaje soma that verse 15 wewe well, verse 15 angalia amemwambiaje ehe mungu aliambia man of god aje so alafu huyu or the prophet anakuja anaambia huyu man of god namna gani so is that god so nani ambaye na contradict the word of god that's one and one person satan period satan is against the word so many of the demons are here in the bible very many great old prophet here a fat man of god here sasa jaribu kukamata this was a counter attack after dealing with that order this was a counter attack i have come to declare may god give you grace to deal with all the demonic counter attacks Alikuja kwanza anaonyeshana kabisa. He was against kile Mungu anasema na ajita out prophet. Hebu angalia verse 16. Mimi nasema, look at this. Kwa nini? Ehe. So goja. Ni nini man of God alifanya nafaa kujua hapa? Kuna mtu amekuja amesema kwamba turudi tukakule. Na yule Mungu alikuambia namna gani? So anajua kwamba these temptations. These are temptations here now. This is not God. Huyu mtu ako against God. So alikuwa nafaa kujitenganisha na immediately. Hakuwa nafaa ku debate. Hakuwa nafaa ku entertain conversation. Hakuwa nafaa ku entertain. But right now nataka nikuonyeshe ali mu entertain. Wakaanza kuongea. Look at this. Angalia vile nilimwambia. Ehe. 
Ama mwe abete? Aya ma? Ah si u? Hata mimi nina pia. Angalia mwenzako mwambie. Hata akiwa ni kama wewe. Haumjaitwa the same. Angalia mwenzako mwambie haitarishika na kopa ako kama. As long as kile anaongea, kinapenga kile Mungu anaongea. You are not like That's the thing. I am not like you. As long as una unapenga kile ambacho Mungu amesema, Mungu amesema tufikue. Bado ananiambia tukule, na ananiambia tuko kama hao. This is the thing. Anamwambia kwamba hata mimi ni nabii kama wewe. Na tunu wangu watu kama wewe. Hata nanenewa kama wewe. Mimi ni mwanabiashara kama wewe. Haya mambo nayajua. Kuna watu watakwambia hivyo. Mimi ni mwibaji kama wewe. Hata mimi nainaga kanisa, hata mimi kwanza nimeokoka kama eh, hata mimi kwanza nikwambie ni, ni huwa na, na kwanza na nafunganga twice per week kama kwanza hata mimi naendanga maombi hata mimi naendanga hata kwa kevas kama basi kila mtu ambaye anajifanya kama wewe utamkubalisha kwa maisha yako angalia mwanzo kumwambia chungo watu ambao wanajifanya kama wewe ah wako against kile ambacho umebeba and church i pray yakomba mungu akulinde na watu kama hawa maana if kuna watu ambao huwezi jua ni watu ambao wanajifanya kama wewe watu ambao wanajifanya kwamba ni wakanisa kabisa watu ambao wanajifanya kwamba they speak in tongues wanasema wanaweza pewa waongoze kukura chakula muongee in tongues the whole house kwa sababu wanaanza kulia before me father Jesus God is in chakula Jehova go oh Jesus is you meant to pay father guy Paka mnaanza kulia all of you Na najifanya kama Angalia mwanzako mwambie ule adui mkubwa sana ni yule ambaye ni kama Yule ambaye anajifanya kama wiwi anaweza kuangamiza sana huyu mtu So now look at this I wonder in Miss Penagi history na huwa naitukia let me let me just you open see Penagi I've already gave she a pardon mkono umewitha Si tulikuwa tumejazika hapo na vile amenenea ota lakini kifanganga hapa hii story huwa mimi ne sasa wacha nimalize sasa tuende nyumbani eh wacha nitoe nyumbani mimi eh Watu wa nyumba tusome kwa haraka Nani ameongea? Anamwambia nani ameongea? Angel ameniongea. Yaani angel na contradict kile Mungu aliongea. Angalia mweza kama be any voice. Ina contradict the voice of God. It's a demonic voice. Simple and clear. No debate. Must discuss. Nasema kwamba angel hata mimi. Na hakuna kitu kimbaya kama mtu anasema nimeo, nimeonyeshwa. Nimekuona. Niliona. Niliabiwa nilimenewa hizi maneno zinakuanga zimedaganya watu wengi sana these are not the prophet and able to say your statement kwa haraka hata go hata ikiwa umekutana na old prophet no problem so much no problem uko hapa eh 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 na anasema na anasema an angel said to me by the word of the lord anasema na anajua na daganya yani prophet na mna gani mzee na haogopi mungu anasema angalia bring him back with you to your house so that he may eat it hebu angalia pati ya mwisho how can i lie na unasema kwamba ni mungu ameniambia and you are prophet how can you lie and you are prophet you know kuba kuna watu bwana za kuambia ni Mungu alinibia tufanye biashara na wewe na wanadaganya angalia angalia mwanzo kumwambia watu ambao huwa nakudaganya ni watu ambao wengi sana wanasema wamenenewa sasa hii facebook imejaa watu wamenenewa hii kwanza watu wananenewa kai hii Mungu amesema imejaa Angalia mwanzo kumwambia watch out usikutane na old prophet na huko. 
Yeye akisema anasema kwa bainju na shetani huwa anajifananisha kama malaika wa nuru. Man of God. Hebu angalia hebu angalia verse 19 malize angalia hii. Hii lazima acha hebu angalia. So the I wish you man of God ageomba. Aulize Mungu I contradict me yourself. Mungu niniambia nisiede nikule na nikunywe. Mbona umenenda tena hapa? Angeuliza Mungu na let me tell you if kuna watu wana confessiwa kwa haraka ala tafadhali munisaidie. I'm not against watu. Mimi ni mtu mzuri sana hapa. Let me tell you mimi sina ubaya. But if kuna watu wanadaganywa kwa haraka ni wa mama. Kwanza mama akisema kwamba Mungu amesema. Kuisha. Mutaenda mpaka kwa kitaka na yeye. Hey. Utamuigiza kwa simba na hiyo Mungu ameogea. Angalia mwezo kumwambia si kila mtu bwana anasema Mungu ameongea utamfuata. Hii ilikuwa ni uongo. Man of God abaya tumeona ametumwa na Mungu sana. Paka amefanya mkono wa mfalme uwithi. Anadaganywa na kusema Mungu ameongea. Amishe angeomba. Ah. Afa mimi nataka nifikishe hapo. Hii haina utamu. <laughs> Emu angalia vile anasema uone vile hii alisha. Endelea tu. So wakati wako kwa meza wanakula. So yule old prophet akapokea grace ya yule nabii. Yeye hakuwa na neno la Mwana, alikuwa amezeeka. Sasa naye akaanza kusikia Bwana. Usi nabii nabii aliingia kwa nyumba. Yule nabii mzee hakuwa nasikia kwa Mungu. But this time mradi wakati huu nabii ameingia kwa nyumba. Hey grace kamagukia. Ah! Akaanza kusikia hata yeye. Sasa akasikia ya ukweli. Angalia ya ukweli. Hebu sikia. Usiukesikia kumchapa kofi. Hebu soma hiyo uone kwamba ukimchapa kofi hata wewe. Hebu tusome vizuri sana. He cried out to the Ehe. Ehe. Nani amemfanya hivyo? Nani amemdaganya? Si unafiri kumtaraza kofi? Angeli the next verse inasemaje? Ehe. Hiyo ndio last verse na tukisoma hiyo hatutasoma hiyo Bible hapa tena. Pacheni tusome hiyo tukisoma hiyo hatutasoma tena kwa sababu the more tunateremka the more unasikia pain. <laughs> Angeli verse 24. That was the end of the man of God. Counter attack. He was counter attacked and missed. He died kwa barabara. Ukisoma hiyo verse nyingine, watu walikuwa napita wanajiakaridia. Wanasema guy, hiyo ndio nabii habari tumiwa. Wana point. Guy, 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 guy. Ameuliwa na simba. He died like that. He missed it alitumua na Mungu sana bara alimalizia vibaya sana it is my prayer how tatumiwa na Mungu alafu malizie vibaya kuna watu wamekuwa kama this man of god wamekuwa waibaji wa ufuri wamemalizia vibaya wameuruwa na simba wanatembea bado wanaulewa the apostles walianzia vizuri sana but wameuruwa na simba they are dead spiritually They are dead kimaombi. They are dead kusoma Bible vile wamesoma. Simba ambaye ni shetani amewaua. Why? Kwa nini huyu jamaa amekufa? Alivunja madhabahu. But every alivunja madhabahu akafa kwa hiyo area. Kauta tax. Let me help you to father. Give me only one minute. Nikusaidie. Nikusaidie. I know nina mambo mixer but stop kusema hiyo ya mambo yote. But nisikize nikupe mambo ambayo unafaa kuanalyze. Number one. Ili u defeat counter attacks. 
Watch out the people you are socializing with. Your association is very important. Don't socialize na kila mtu. Aliambiwa kwamba asikule na sikunywe mahali pale. Bali yeye mwenyewe time alianza kusikiza vile old prophet alisocialize na yeye. Aka miss the mark. That was a problem. Kuna watu ambao you don't need them in your life. Discussion begine wachana nazo. The more you entertain them, you miss. Number two, familiarity. Watch out for familiarity. That's why this man ili mbukomba, ili jiu mekujia. Dio hiyo jia. Mungu likuwa nataka kumwenyesha kumbwa asikuwe familia, manaka the things of God. Ukuwa familia nazo, that's why napuwa another way. Kuna watu mbo kile kina waharibu is familiarity. Usikuwe familia na word of God. Usikuwe familia na nini. Aha, familiarity na uwa. Vitu mixa na watu nafaku pukia. Number three, what you need is, another thing is, you need discernment. Discernment. This man of God, I can discern. Yakoba na daganyo na this old prophet. Discernment is very important. I miss, I get one of the sun meta get your coba pana. Oh, you mutu many and be a coba to Rudy to Kakur and Kukunwe. Namuwa in Yambia, Konin and Ajipinga Kirini, I get the sun, but I recosa the sun mate. In win count attacks again, you need the sun mate in your life. The next thing is prayer. Prayer. I wish you and go about this among. Am I supposed to do this, oh God? Or not? Prayer. In Oxide. Then another thing, Muhimu Sanya Misho. Get out of your comfort zone. Get out of your comfort zone. Kire kirifanya na kirileta haya mambo yote. Ni nini? Baibu nasema komba, wakati alienda na katoka kudiri na that order. Alienda kakaa chini ya mti. Prophet, old prophet ya malikuja alimkuta komba mekaa chini ya mti. Imagine. So alienda kawa akakaa kwenye comfort zone na haja mariza assignment yake. Alikutua chini ya mti ya meketi. Study kwa Bible. Watu wengi sana mekaa chini ya mti wanamalizio vibaya. Kwenye comfort zone. Talk about Elijah. Alienda chini ya mti kwenye comfort zone. Akaishi hapo. Ministry yake kapua Elijah. Talk about soul. Alika chini ya mti. Wakati chona thani yada kupia na wafristi. The only person na baile kuwa chini ya mti. Mara kasaidiwa kutoka isi Nathaniel. Alito toke chini ya mti. Kwenye convert zone. So alienda kaka chini ya mti kwa barabara na haja mariza assignment. Alima risiki hapa. Usui kubaku kubari kukaa kwenye convert zone. Angeli mweza kumambia mumariza your assignment. Alijisa hao. Ile jia kepita before simba atoke. But alitiregire kwa barabara. Akarude na kitokea simba. Kakutana na ee kwa barabara. Mungu alikuwa mprotect kutoka kwa Simba but alikaa kwenye convert zone. Kaisha. We God help us from today to win all counter attacks in the name of Jesus Christ. Tusimame. Angeli mweza kumambia, how to go come this man of God? Ebu mwambia tena hivo? Mwambia, how to anthia biyashara vizuri? Alafu, uisha vibaya. How to ansha huduma yako vizuri? Alafu, imarizia vibaya sana. Mwambia from today, pokea grace ya kuanthia na kumarizia. In the name of Jesus. Alafu nataka to do me a favor. Just do me a favor. You, if you have brother here, tafuta brother ako mahari yako. If una mtoto wako, tafuta mtoto wako mahari ya lipo. If kuna mzee, tafuta mzee wako mahari ya lipo. Nataka right now we silence ota ambazo zinekamata familia. Nataka, my wife atakuja hapa. Minta atuko na my wife hapa. Tafuta wife yako. Ambasida if hauko na ee, sasa atijuku takuwaje. Eh, eh. Hey, if we ni mtoto tafuta mamako mahali yako tafuta mamako mahali yako like you know we are praying for families if sister zako if cousin yako iyo ni familia moja if auntie yako iyo ni familia moja karuka za kalaba tunawaka moto sasa any ota inaungia kwa familia this is the day kwa za itajariji watobo wanawacha kwa nyumba 
Ilifumeacha mtoto wako kwa nyumba hii ndio sasa ile challenge kubwa ya leo. Sasa mtaomba na nani mnafaa kuomba na mtoto wako. Leo haukuja na yeye. Oh Jesus. Hivyo ndivyo roho mtakatifu ana anafanya mambo vivoni ni. Nataka sasa yeye akushika. Yes. My God. Hata ikiwa ni anti, shika anti yako. yote ya magojwa yote ya kansa fort of now nataka kwa mshika mwenza kwa right now continue bring it side is in the fort of anza kuwaka moto sasa anza kubikiria haya madhabahu yananyonya mpaka mvu zako za kiroho shataka bao shataka rabandu riko shiti karamaya what am i calling kamata bonako anza kuomba na bonako ombeni biashara yenu ombeni mpaka hiyo ndoa kila mara ingia hiyo
Kisha rekete keza goshi ya rapoko zete kanda Rekote keza goshi ya ramama magote keza begeshi ya Rekota kanda magote keza beshiri ya mando bote keza atoleshina Rekoshi ya pakata ramama uzekete kasha ramama yanda Just do it I know, kabisa just run there it I know Wambe, 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 wambe sasa Shiku ite rekete kama gato kwa uzikiri ya asha Rekata kanda magote keza beshiri ya paya We break the satas in the name of Jesus we break the satas in the name of Jesus, oh God. We break the satas, oh God. Bakali ashata. Somebody has said, I said the foot on my rose. I said the foot on my children, oh child. I said the foot on the Kutangana Jehovah God. Ea pakata polite kere kalamashata. Ea keke kere magote keze kere mabosaya. Ea kato koze kete kere magato koze kete magote kaza. Ea pakata kalo keshe kere baya. Shikatara magato kezaya. Ya maga toko zekere bashi karama ya toya Ya pakatori ya shata karama muzato Ya pashi ala matoko zaya Stagnation si na unboka right now Stagnation si na unboka right now Katama goto kwa watoto wako Katama goto kwa watoto wako Katama goto kwa watoto wako right now Shariko tere zatari ya shaya Watoto wato wato fato na magojo Katama goto kwa yo fast bona Magojo kwa yo fako bona zagona Shikatakandogoshiriabandogoshiaratata,ekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekekek
kuna watu wanaona kuna father hii yote imenisumbua but oh god i silence this order from today imekamata mwili wangu imekamata pesa zangu right now nataka kwa dakika moja saa hii jiombe for one minute ama koshi kana matatu jiombe for one minute chochote na minia cha hofu tote hizo za pili let's pray for it right now and the stronghold is coming down oh pakashiria pata kofu fia sha ajara za barabara zinaondoka ajara za barabara zinaondoka madhabahu ya fefe na disappear we pray for the grace of god now shiri pato kosete ke ashata hey shofa ka sharata ta 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 ya ene pakato ya shanda let her go for us break right now let her go for us break right now let her go for us break right now katika chena la yesu kristo madhabahu ya uchuri ya nafunjika ya uchuri ya nafunjika ya kata 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 kana basha ya uchuri ya nafunjika right now This is your day. This is your day. Yes Lord. Baba unakomboa watu hapa. Baba unakomboa watu hapa. Baba unakomboa watu hapa. Unakomboa familia ya mahali hapa. Unakomboa familia ya mahali hapa. Unakomboa familia ya mahali hapa. Kaka po shaka tomo takastenisha manifest creation fala. Lika la hasto kesha mala hazo tekete hari ya shata. Lika hasto kesha maha to ko takana matonti ya sati kasha. Lika station manifest kata manando ko sereka. Woo! Hey Jesus 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 Jesus. Sheke ke 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 ka ko rikali ya shanda. Pakote kaza toki ya shandi kotaya. Madabahu ya linoriwa. Yare madabahu tone ya vunja. Hallelujah Jesus. La poca stari kushi kama nando bokos. Haliko fakisa kama mama nando bokos tikishi ni vasa rakanda. In the name of Jesus oh God, farosi tala madando. Yes. 
Kuna watu right now wanataka tuombe na wao sasa hivi. Kuna watu right now wanataka tuombe na wao sasa hivi. If umethumburua na umethumburua na arthritis. Inua tu mkono mahali ulipo. If umethumburua na arthritis. Arthritis. Hii ni kitu Mungu aliniambia kuanzia jana. Rimia kwamba leo naponya watu wa arthritis. Na leo nimekuja na assignment na grace ya watu ambao wako na arthritis. Saita baki kwenu. Hala kusha kalama arthritis. Fa ino tu mkono vizuri usiokope. Father God. Hawa watu ambao wanafuatwa na arthritis father. I command arthritis. Here the word of the Lord has arthritis. Spirit now. Arthritis toka kwa hawa katika jina la Yesu. Arthritis disappear in the name of Jesus. Arthritis and the right is and the right is and the right is in the name of Jesus. Oh my God. Lushi kama kantu bazara shara madandu. Wacha tukido wash. Praises wacha tu ni msongese pare mwush mnini. Kitongo tu. Leo Mungu alinituma kwa arthritis. Najua kuna watu wengine taume but arthritis nataka kudi nao sana. Hata iko na nifuatu kwa online na uko na arthritis. Visions you the God is going to heal you. Na watu wa arthritis pili pia maana kesi Sunday mtatoa testimony. I want to deal with arthritis. Ah. Yasaidia tu mwenzako hiyo tu msijari tunaenda mahali pakubwa. Hii iko squeezed sana. Nimeona kwamba ni watu wako wengi huko nitazidi kuzunguka na huko ndani. If you come on my sugar one at the right is mama to have at the right is I want to deal with at the right is right now at the right is at the right is give me a bill bill what to at the right is if you come on at the right is no kusumbua within 10 minutes and attack and go to groups mingi sana mahali hapa oh my god hallelujah 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 oh allow me to be a sugar one at the right is a good year jesus kia mahali hapa na wakati alisikia kwamba it is a prophetic sana alikuja sana na akamwambia father father nataka tu pastor aniite tu anipoint aniite ili baba ni enjoy hiyo grace ulikuja ulikuja papa seri na unajua kama hii ulikuja hapa na uliomba hiyo be father nataka kwa prophetic sana nataka tu pastor anipoint ili nipokee kile ambacho na mimi ya father if umekuja hapa na hati kama hiyo simama kwenye hiyo reni ya pili Mungu ameona kilio chako kuna watu walikuja wakati nimetaka tu pastor aseme kitu juu yangu kwa prophetic sana Mungu ameona your heart na baba na tender maana this is your day there is that grace for this order <laughs> haleluya pakusha kalama ya ndoba mama makushi rika za tai mosha talama acha za galieni nasikia arthritis inaondoka kuna neema mingi hapa
Even if you are going to kwa stairs. Na right now kwa misimama hapo. Mungu meza kufungua kwanzia mbigu yako. Kakako ufakishi maya. Kuna grace itafanya. Places utakanyanga hauta tolewa. Ati kwa ni kuofisi. Na kuna favor mungu meachilia. Na ene mwende ya likuwa mekukata. Right now kuna those connections mungu watakuwa. Let me just tell you this now. Like the story of Isaac time when he was on Abimelech, then Abimelech a kind of come on me, come God is with you. That will be your story. It is done. It is done. It is done, sister. Receive that grace. Receive that grace. Receive that grace. Receive that grace. Receive that grace in the name of Jesus. Receive that. Grace. Tembea na hiyo grace katika jina la Yesu. Loshika maya. Ii ni anini mami? I came here first in April. Thank you. That's why I'm going to Thank you. May I receive that grace, ma'am? Mm -hmm. I came here in April. April. Yeah, in April. Okay. And if you could remember, I'm the lady who I came in March 22nd for the first time. And I saw my first miracle on 25th where my brother-in-law died, if you could remember. And then in April, I won a green card. And now I'm here to pray for speed of processing my green card. One. Secondly, I want to be a kingdom investor in CCI. In Jesus' name. The reason why I met her sister, I met her and I met her to another level. I want to make up my green card. May God take you to those levels in Jesus' name. May God take you to those levels in the name of Jesus. Receive the speed of God now. That speed of God in the name of Jesus. If we your sister, I'm a wind green card. So listen to this now. This one is special. This one is special. This one is special.
hiyo grace father ifuko hawa watu wote wamekuja hapa hizo praises wanataka kutembea na watu mafada na hivyo wamesema kwamba natakuwa investor wa CCI i declare father in the name of jesus it is done it is done jesus alinde tu mwambie it is done hey mwambie tu it is done hivi umetangazwa na mimi nimetangaza kwamba it is done now jesus name na mimi nimetangaza hivi umetangazwa it is done now in the name of jesus go and say if it is done go and that faith now and then that faith hiyo atakuombe kisha tu hivi ameonekana kisha nao Napenda hiyo Napenda board kabisa nasema pasta nataka hiyo green card nataka green card Father hiyo green card haipokee from the name of Jesus Hiyo green card father haipokee in the name of Jesus Fungurisha fungurisha Name of Jesus Ifu, ifu na joko mbogo hapa Na kuna njimbo meandiko nataka kutua Hata we na kuombea kama vile huyu sister Iyo na emu ima mwangukia Are you there? Kea sifa he Kea sifa zote Na utuku Emu sikia iyo wipo
Baba, oh, mwito na mwito. Tangaza baba, iyo grace ifo. Na ushidi onekane. Mi ujiza yonekane, Father. Na nime declare makupo from today in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Zile, someone zile hubiru hapa. Wimbo umekuwa kijireta kwa kida someone. Tunataka hivyo. Ah! Ah! Hei, kuwanza ni nini wewe nyibo uja tu? kuingia hapa praise alafu unaona kitu kinakuzuilia simama hapa if unatama nangi kuwa mwibaji ala kwa praise hapa alafu unasikia kwa kitu kinakuzuilia kuja hapa kwa mbea neema simama matu hapa ene ya naombea watu opposite simama mi this is a prophetic sunday prophetic sunday na kuwanga nini Oh, 
it is done mami kakosh problem ya kifua kama udani yake name of jesus name of jesus no more can't sort it from today na mami kosha kikakosha name of jesus hiyo problem ya kifua nimekatara father no more asthma no more asthma from today name of jesus I like that. Yaani kuna watu mbona nasema kwamba niko na hiyo hamu kama mzee rafiki hapa. Are you there? Just give me a beauty baba. Unajua kwamba ile grace Mungu anachilia. Unajua kwamba Mungu anaweza kuona natamani kwamba eh huwa anajua natamani kucheza gitaa kidogo na nasema ni kwamba hiyo gitaa flow nayo. Let's declare that grace. Baba tumetangaza katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Hiyo neema we declare baba. Unaonekana unatenda makubwa na majabu. Rapaka stikiri bush. Ripaka na matanda bato possession. She does name. nyimbo zilikuwa zinakuja usiku au juu zilienda wapi tumezileta mpaka mchana sio usiku tu zikuja mpaka mchana in the name of jesus hizo nyimbo tumeziita tena na jesus name hivi baya sana kuu unaziona kwa ndoto alafu zina disappear kwa ndoto zikuja mpaka physical yes sister imekushika kuna mtu mwingine kuna kitu nimemshika wewe unasema kwamba kuna kitu nimemshika hii side moja nasikia nimemshika hivyo if kuna kitu nasikia wewe ndio kutubu umekushika kuja hapa Unasema unajua huyu Jerobo alisema arrest. Yes. Unasema kwamba hey, like that that good. Kuna kitu nasikia kwamba kimekushika whether ni kichwa mbongo bavu wewe haujui ni nini. Unasikia kwamba umeshikwa. This is the day. Sister ame amesimamia. Ame Nimesema leo niona bibi Mungu analeta watu na jie nyingine ya maajabu sana hapa. So if unasikia kwamba umeshikwa kuja hapa. Jeroboam alisema kwamba arrest see that man. Then kuna nini? Kuna mtu mwingine. Wewe well, utusimama tu. Yes, ma. Oh this hand. Oh my god, I like this. This hand is not strong enough. Father in the name of Jesus Christ. I declare Father strength right now. Our daddy is you now. Shako bagara. Ripasho piki zai busha. Karaba bushiti bagosti karibaya. Umkono wake bado nimeombea from now. Hamtamsu risha. Bato causation now. Hamtamsu fortification for it aya. Ritaiko shitika takalibo sikili ya shati manando va. Baba nimetangaza nguvu mpya kwa mwili wake. Gofu mpya father vile umemleta hapa natangaza ushindi na neema Jesus name Yes unasikia Kitu kimekushika Yes sir Deliverance Father Ota zote mbaya Madabahu mbaya Disappear by the fire Shuria hawa Nafungwa migu Nafungwa mikono Nafungwa mbavu Nafungwa kidi nefunga Name of Jesus Devil you are liar Hawa hauta wafuata Makao shalalala ya nondi gashata Natangaza moto ukumbozu right now Natangaza moto ukumbozu right now Kala usha Naiko shiti kana mamata Disappear Iyo kitu ina mshika Iyo ndoke right now Jesus, let the from now. Your kid 
to disappear. I am father. Oh, watch and be able to cast me and lead you. Yosh, to a yoke of go. Name of Jesus. Nakata come go. I take a matter of from now. Nothing won't go the name of Jesus. Nothing won't go right now. Attack forty. I chill you go right now. I chill you go right now. Kill a kifungo. Come out. Come out kifungo. Come out kifungo. Come out kifungo in the name of Jesus. Come out kifungo in the name of Jesus. Shato kozesho marivosi para magara. Nako shiki te migato gezo mikalia. Shiri bagoti zarisha ragaya. Ashes hawa wana fanya. Zote zinafuata masomo na kata raina Umakoshi magarama Naino Jesus ugao Nafuwe na masomo ya kifada From today Jesus name If if watoto wako wamekuwa kigojeka gojeka simama pamoja na huyu anasema kwamba watoto wangu wamekuwa kigojeka nataka uombe tuombe hao watoto wamekuwa kigojeka gojeka in grace Prophetics are in attack to be an e favor. If what to make a conjo out, I'll go part in a familia, Unataka will be in a familia. You may be stuck to go to the other familia. I want to come back on familia. Your grist, now you may come on familia is very important. So, Naka, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I want to come back on familia, no problem there. If what to walk on a spring of a gojo, Smama Harper. Kanisa tunaosha mikono tuelekeze kwa hawa. 
Baba katika jina takatifu na Bwana Yesu Kristo. Hao wamesimama hapa kwa ajili ya watoto wao. Wamekuwa kisumburiwa na magonjwa fadha. You are healer. Tumeonyesha mtu tumeonyesha mikono kwa hawa. Hawatasumburiwa na magonjwa tena. Father they are free watoto wao. Kuanzia yule mdogo mpaka yule mkubwa amefunguliwa. Baba pesa zao hazitakuwa na magonjwa from today. We speak favor and that grace na neema kwa hawa. In Jesus name. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Haya, familia nataka hii familia. Familia Baba katika jina takatifu na Bwana Yesu Kristo huyu baba amekuwa faithful na kila mpea na kifungulisha utazidi kumuinua nao Jesus name. Baba hii familia anaiombea na umbea kazi ya mikono yao. Naiombea baba mpaka Mungu ile kazi wanafanya na tangaza favor. Naombea mpaka watoto mmewapea. Jehovah utazidi kuonekania na kuwalinda. Natangaza neema na nguvu za kimaajabu na ushindi wa kimaajabu. Walinde baba wapiga nie from now. Na milango baba ya supply na pesa zao hazitafungwa nje. In Jesus name. Amen. Ifukusha faribu fakata rabagosti kiri baya Fatika bagusha ramamamati kizibisha ramamatanda Rapaka tukuzishu marivusi kiri boshi ya ramataya Jesus name Bakota father go mamia mesimamia Watoto iyo madabahu baba ni meikata haita unge kwa watoto They are free from now Jesus name Oh, that's good Mbaka wa eh Hey, hiyo ni nzuri. Baba hii familia tumeiombea katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Hakuna madhabahu mambo yataongea kwa hawa. Tumefungulisha dia zao na mambo yao. We speak favor na ushindi wa kimaajabu. Hawangangani tena fadha. Baba tumetangaza milango hii imefunguka na dia zao zimefunguka. In Jesus name. Hakuna kitu kizuri kama familia by the way. Watu kiboa kama familia ni muhimu sana. Baba hii familia tunaiombea favor na ushindi wa kimaajabu na neema. Huyu ni kile breakthrough go. Umeona kanimu wapiga shule ushindi baba unaofuata na nguvu za kimaajabu. Baribu sotika mabai na fursa takaza rama mazako bisho nao. She does name. But after this tutombea watu after this. Tutombea watu hapa. Inua tu mikono yako. Kuna watu tunaomba after this tutombea watu hapa wengi sana. Haleluya. Baba katika jina takatifu na Bwana Yesu Kristo. Hawa kila mahitaji wako nayo tunayoombea, favor tunaifungulisha. Nyumba zao zimefunguliwa, safari zao, tenda zao, pesa zao father. Hakuna hata zitawafuata, hakuna magonjwa tawafuata. Hawa wanafuata na ushindi baba, kaonekanie na kuwatendea na kuwapigania na ushindi wafuate. Katika jina la Yesu Kristo tuna maana hata kuamini. Amen, amen. Baada ya tujamaliza maombi tukimaliza ibada na baki na watu hapa tukuombea bado ni mapema sisi sasa tunataka tulisi watu wengine alafu tutabariki tukua basha kwa taifa so immediately after this wala mwana taka kuombua kama familia bado tutuombea wala mwaku na ishi bazo ni private tutaziombea hapa right now and after this Asha saidia ni tuha watu. Hata uneza saidia tu yukitu yuko hapo. Mwese jari, by the way, tunaenda kwetu. It's only for three Sundays tuko hapa. Tuko tunambiwa hivi ya titu. Najua Mkobozi wangu Hey Anaishi Anaishi Anjua Mkobozi wangu Wa wa Anaishi Anaishi Tukwa yu bahasha ya Ivo na tumia watu namba there is there six seven seven eight fifteen that's what you number there is our account number there there is a tumia ni kwete
kama katika jina takatifu na Bwana Yesu Kristo. Watu wako wanapokutolea fungu la kumifana. Wengine shukrani Jehovah God. Wendekelea zile baraka zinaandamana na watu ambao wamekutolea. Zikawafuate uko atende na kuonekanie na milango yao imofungukia. In Jesus name. In Jesus name. In Jesus name. So na tunapoimba wimbo mmoja hapa, just bring your bahasha hapa. Then after that kimaliza tutakuwa na wakati ukombea watu hapa kwa njia kubwa sana na tukombea mpaka familia yako kwa njia ya maajabu sana kwa maana baba anatenda na baba anaonekana katika jina la Yesu Kristo. So tunapopea wimbo just come here. Alafu tubarikiwe kwa Mungu anavutupia wimbo pale. Oh, acha kama wapo. Eh, Walio na majina makubwa. Hawawezi linganishwa. Wewe bwana Hata kama wapo yeye walio na sifa dunia ni yeye hawezi linganishwa na wewe bwana wewe ni mwana wewe ni bwana juu ya mwana hakuna Your praise as my coffee, my son. I'm going to come on be a hari. I could be bad liquor. Mombia, you are the next one. Could you have a very poor testimony? Atam Fukuako may change. Atam Fuko. Tupigia praise us on a pocket one as book to do a rusu a pocket one. So God bless you, Mungo Monacania. Watch out to Marisa and release what one of Tatuki Nini. And we thank God for this. Oh, but then can you see Mahari Chachi Mifika now? Look at that. Oh, gosh. So that's the far you have gone. And, uh, we are having our grad opening on uh, 24th, on 24th of July. So we have only three Sundays. We have only three Sundays. Iri to end of our church. You can see inje huko kutamalizua kutoweko hapo kuna trazo zinaweko hapo inje hivo. Ukiangalia huko the keys mewekwa, ukiangalia kwa drisha ziko. Avio, vimeweko huko. Hapo, ragi kuna ragi mebaki kupako hapo chini, unaona itapako hapo. And uh, hapo, unaona hapo kuna ide, the, the, the miracle well. The miracle well starting from this week, tutatengeneza what called baptismo pool. Immediately after kufungua, tunabatiza watu hapo tunyuma. Tuwaingiza hapo, tunawabatiza. Kwanza, ush. Karibu mtu wa vitu kanakomba tarubi, ush. Unajua, iyo, iyo diyo, hapo dipo, ile maji yote imemaliza charge inatoka. Hakuna maji tumetumia ya kanju. Hakuna maji ya kanju tumetumia. Hakuna maji tumenunua. Iyo kisima, iyo mungu lipia, na tumaji ya katoka tu hapo. Yote, hata mkitumia na tushona na magani, itatokanga hapo. Na sasa, itabidi mahali pale, tuhakishia kwa mba, iyo maji diyo, takuwa tunabatiza watu. So, from to, this week, pana tegenezo nao hapo kuwa na baptismo pool, tutaigiza watu hapo kwa maji ya mujiza. Na tumira kwa we. Na fili, na fili, usai fili kurudiwa. Iyo maji, najua iyo maji si mtu wa meireta hapo ni mungu. So unataka tu batizo tu hapo. Kana kwa mungu ya mtu wakakua na rudiwa, nike rudiwa, sasa kuta kwa ufili iyo. Lakini sasa, wacha niyamini tu kwa sawa. So, lakini watu ambao, watu ambao memuagiruwa maji, sasa kuliga na sisi bilifu yetu. Sisi bilifu yetu, au jabatizwa. So, lazima tukuingize kurendani. 
lazima tukuingize uko ndani utoke kuwa wet kila mahali na ukiinua mkono juu hivi tunakurudisha tena mpaka uingie ule tusikuone hata pati yote <laughs> so and we thank God for that so nataka tukidogo tu twende through uh, tuweze tuingie kutoka kwa mlango kutoka kwa mlango ah uh, by the way can you see those are washrooms can you see vile ziko mm bona hamsemi ile kitu mnasemaga mm <laughs> Ah, uh, that's it. Hiyo ni saidi ya wazee. Hiyo ni saidi ya wazee. So kuna wamama wako na saidi yao, wazee wako na saidi yao. Hiyo ni saidi ya wazee. Unaona tu mezi mmeweka tiles. Just look at that. Mmeweka tiles. Zimeweka tiles. Hiyo ni mahali ya watoto pa na watu bado wanataka nini? Pa kujisaidia hapo. Uh, ziko huko unaona? Ziko sawa huko. Just look at that. Uh, oh my god. Ya ya ya. Hiyo unaona hapo hiyo ni kitchen. Hiyo ni kitchen iko hapo. Hiyo ni kitchen ya chini. Si ya kule juu ni kitchen ya chini. Ndio hiyo iko hapo. Oh my god. Look at that. Just look at that. By the way, mambo ya mafudi, mambo ya mchanga na nini? Mafudi wamemalizana. I believe akomba wale mafudi tuko tumebakishani watu bwana tengeneza the baptism pool. But sasa ukiangalia dani ndasahau dani iko lakini dani still kuna ile kale inawekwa ndani haijawekwa but on starting from tomorrow mpaka saturday mambo ya ragi itakuwa imeisha mambo ya ragi itakuwa imeisha tulazo imewekwa mahali kote utaangalia huko juu imeanza kusuguliwa na machini alafu tu ni acid itamwagiliwa mahali pale then ikifikia ikifikia saturday itakuwa imeisha so tuko tumebakisha only groups mbili huko watu ambao ndio wa pale mbele wa chips ambao wameanza kutengeneza already pale mbele wanatengeneza pale mbele na kule juu kwa ofisi wanaweka huko juu and uh, look at that huko ni sehemu ya nyuma angalia uh, na huko nyuma if haujatembea pale hiyo kuna space una unaweka unaficha huko vitu kama generator unafika huko si naona mpaka kitchen eh eh, eh. Designer wa mpaka tu vikombe tuna anakana hapo that's that's how in a car that's how in a car you said yani meaning chat imeisha na uko nini na uko so ni ragi tu itakuwa itaisha this week uh, tilazo itasuguriwa this week kabisa ah uh, hii kinisa tumebakisha only vitu mambo ya stima fittings za stima hizo zimebaki fittings za stima hizo zimebaki then uh, ni waya za HDMI zimebaki zinafaa kununuliwa za kama za 40 40 50000 40 50000 za kuna zile zimewekwa already huko ndani kuna zingine zimebaki za kama 20000 20000 zimebaki then hiyo ingine ni ku mm, ni speak, speakers ni speakers mambo kama hayo sasa hiyo ni ile kubwa sana moja imebaki ni gypsum by the way ana dango baada kuna mama ambaye ana duka kubwa sana gekomba kubwa sana gekomba akuza actually ni ana ile duka kubwa sana ya jeep sabu gekomba imagine ametusikiza tu online saa akatumbia kwa kwanza kujieni vitu hapa kwangu ni mpe na akatupea kadhaa alafu zile zikini ambazo sasa hajatupea ah uh, tutanunua so tunanunua kwake kwa hivyo tunahitaji kama hiyo ndio tunahitaji only half a million only half a million only only have a million only ndio tunahitaji hiyo tukua na hiyo saa saa tutakuwa tumemaliza unaangalia huko kwa nazidi kusuguru angalia huko huko juu kuko kuzuri sana just look at that kwa kuzuri sana huko already so tomorrow watamalizia chini watu watilazo watamalizia chini alafu warudie mara ya pili alafu wapake huko acid ah na kuambia ukipita hapo utaona mpaka unaona kwamba before uombe maombi yamefika before tuombe maombi tu yamefika before hata uombe ifuombe. Kwa hivyo hakisha kwamba tuna grad na that's why readers will meet. Na bado tuna kuna leaders ambao tuta officially hii day after ku ku open kanisa kuna watu ambao still tuta anoint for waweke kwa groups fulani tuongeze leaders kwa groups fulani na to introduce is gina mahali. But so we are planning for that grand opening kubwa sana ambayo itakuwa sasa tunaendelea vizuri sana. Wamama kuna vile tunaamini kwamba tutakuwa wazee wazee kuna vile tutakuwa wazee tutakuwa Mm, and then ashas kuna viru watakuwa kabisa wazuri sana na tutatoka hapa na tunaongozwa na bad kuza na ile bad wanapiga mpaka na wanapiga mpaka hizi tunazunguka hivyo na wanapiga hivyo wanapuliza tujulikane tuko na kristo ni anatawala 
hatufanyi kompeni tunafanya kompeni ya Mungu hatutakuja hapa tetoke hapa tuende tuingie kanisa ha. unajua hatutakuja direct kwa kanisa tutakuja kwanza hapa then tuongozwe na na bishop wa kuwa na sana zile nguo wa sasa sasa tufanye mkutano mkubwa sana tuende hivyo tutelemkie hapa hivyo tuende chini hivyo kwa hiyo bado kituongoza inagonga tu inagonga tu inagonga tu na hizi zina nini hapo tukuje hivyo nao tukuje tufungue mahali pale then alafu tuingie ili tuanze service god agile mweza kumwambie be part of this agile mweza kumwambie kitu kiko sawa tunamalizia mambo ya gypsum na tumalizie fitting za mambo ya stima then from there is only speakers speakers na kuna watu nazidi kunenewa now the problem ni mimi niko na problem yapi watu wa service wani ombe kama kuna sister na ninajua kwa bana nisikiza sister ninaomba tu msamaha nisamehe tu nikosea but nisamehe tu na nisamehe aliona kwa bana ngangana na hii mic kushika hapa nikiombe na nilikuwa ninangangana nayo akasema kwa bana tanunua mic yangu akaka hapa eh na kanitumia 120000 ninunue maiki hapa lakini mimi ni nani nikazipeana kuiweka trezor <laughs> na nimenunua maiki hapa hmm? ya 120 lakini sasa hizo pesa nimezimejenga sasa naomba tu Mungu aingilie kati kwa sababu ikifika kosa kufunguliwa na angalia aone sina na alitupa 120 kinajua kwamba <laughs> by the way kuna mtu ambaye alinunua hiyo akatuma lakini nilizitumia kwa mjengo niliona kwamba kuna hitaji ni kama vile nimesema kwamba mtu ambaye jana alituma atatununua base speaker mbili na ni kweli sister nitanunua base speaker but before nunue base speaker sana sikia kuwa tempted hata my wife alikuwa ananiuliza bona na transfer pesa na ziweka pressing nimwambia nisipoweka sikae hapa tomorrow nitazitumia kulipa mafundi <laughs> So nilikuwa nazifita zikae hapo nilizione sasa ikae ikiwa ni ya speaker kwa sababu amenunua base speaker mbili baada ya mtume 160000 nilinunua base speaker mbili imagine tupige huyo dada makofi mazuri sana tupige huyo mama mama yetu simamia at least quarter ya gypsum zinatumika tumtumie makofi tumpige makofi maji anazitoa kwa duka yake akasema kwamba zitumike kwa ni kazi ya bwana that's good mungu amariki sana wala bwana ajitolea thank you so much Mbaya kuna mtu ambaye alijitolea kutunua screen. Na katuma 130,000 screen kubwa tununue. Lakini nilizitumia kujenga. <laughs> Lakini naamini kwamba before tufungue hiyo screen itakuwa. Ile ilikuwa ya kujenga kwa sababu inakuja tutanunue hiyo screen. Who knows kana kwamba brother anaweza kuwa hapa Mungu ni nini? Hii maubi tunaomba hapa. Si anaweza kuja na screen. Na ni screen ya pale kubwa na ingine hapa but hapa kingine tutaweka kingine hapa kikubwa hapa katikati <laughs> Lakini sasa kuna kaskini kingine tugine tudogo kama hizi pale juu na kuna ingine si kubwa juu kabisa huko kwa sababu still huko watu watakuwa na kaa second floor bado kuna hall tunataka still screen mahali pale so mahali utasikia kuwa na nono mahali utanenoa na Mungu na kila anenoa na Mungu kufanya that's do it for the glory of God tusimame May the God of hope May the God of hope Angalia mwenza kwa mwambie now may the God of hope As you fall And now may the grace of Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Shuari all the days of my life. Mimi kuna mtu ambaye hajaokoka nikufungilie. Hii hii ni vibaya sana. If you hajaokoka ukitaka kuokoka ndio nishike mkono wako hivi. Kuna mtu kama huyo. So God bless you Mungu amuonekanie. So if unahitaji maombi tuko hapa tunakuombea. Wednesday miracle service. If I would attend, oh, you're missing a lot. So let me just get this.
Chuzi na Friday tume change vile huwa tunafanya kwa sababu kuna watu ambao wanakuja asubuhi wanataka tu waombewe specifically hawataka kuongea so tukifika asubuhi tunaombea watu ambao wanataka kuombewa waenda wafungue biashara tunaombea maombi alafu tunawalilisa wanaenda kufungua biashara tunabaki na watu wale wengine ambao wanataka tuongee na wao so if unakuja Tuesday or Friday na unataka tu kuombewa uende kufungua biashara tukifika saa moja hapa au tukisema ni saa moja au tukifika saa mbili tu, tunaombea hawa watu tunawalilisa wanaenda kufungua biashara zao tunawabariki biashara zao wanaenda na that favor alafu hao wengine ambao wanakaka wanataka tuulizana maswali alafu hao wengine tunawaombea na tunaombea kuligana na vile wamefika so hiyo tumechange hivyo kwa sababu kuna watu ambao wanataka tu wakuje waombewe no release god bless you i love you na nitangaza kwamba hakuna madhabahu yataongea tena na hakuna counter attack itakuweza na hautakufa kama that man of god shalom i love you